Welcome back to the channel. If you follow my Facebook and YouTube channels, you might have noticed the lack of scale modeling related content lately. I've been and am still very busy with other things, but I try my best to get back into modeling and bring you more content now. However, I had the opportunity to visit a couple of aviation museums and two air shows this year, so if you're a modeler, you can find plenty of reference pictures for your models on my Facebook page and Instagram. In today's video, we'll have a look at another MiG-29 in 70 second scale. This time I got the MiG-29 of the Russian aerobatic team SWIFTS from the company ICM. A quite interesting paint scheme for the fulcrum, but I'm not sure yet if I'll build it in this library. Let's have a quick look. The box design is different to what I'm used to from other kit manufacturers. Inside we find the manual and the parts protected in plastic. Let's start with the manual. Here you can already see red markings on the parts that you won't need if you build the Swifts version. For obvious reasons, aerobatic teams don't carry any armament. Here we can also find the decals. Oh, that's a rather short manual. It seems like they put several steps of the assembling process in a few pictures. Okay, why not? It still looks quite comprehensible to me. And over here we can find the painting and decal guide, unfortunately in black and white only. And here the side perspective and below that an overview of the paints needed. ICM only mentions Model Master and AK paints here. Now to the decals. It looks like we need to paint that stylized bird on the MiG ourselves, because you only get those border lines. Furthermore, there are no stencils whatsoever, but the print quality looks good to me. And a quick look on the clear parts. Unfortunately, there are a few scratches on them, even though they were packed in plastic. Hopefully, I can polish that out. And the other sprues. Here we can find the fuel tanks and air-to-air -air missiles that you won't need for the Swift team. And here are parts for the landing gear. They look quite detailed. The next one with the wings and stabilizers. Very fine recessed panel lines and the detail here on the landing gear doors is excellent. And here are the cockpit parts which also look great. All those rivets here are really nice. And finally a sprue with the fuselage halves and engine nacelles. Again some nice details in the landing gear bay and overall I have to say that this is a huge difference to the Mr. Craft kit of the Fulcrum. If you haven't seen it, check out my unboxing of that horrible kit too. Anyways, the ICM MiG-29 looks fine to me, so I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and bye.